Hello and welcome to another complete Cambridge IGCSE PE lesson, the second topic in Chapter 8, Skilled Performance. As always, we'll cover absolutely everything you need to know for your exam, and today you need to be able to identify the six main characteristics of skilled performance, and to explain the role and importance of these characteristics in different sports. In our last lesson, we learned that frequent practice over long periods of time is essential if we are to learn skills and produce skillful performances. But what is skilled performance? Well, when we observe a performance or watch a player perform a movement, we're able to determine whether they are skillful by identifying one or more of the following characteristics. Accurate, consistent, fluent, coordinated, aesthetically pleasing, and goal-directed. Accurate means achieving precise, reliable movements and is particularly important in games such as netball when passing to a marked player or shooting at goal. Accuracy is also essential for bowlers when aiming at the stumps, basketball players when shooting from distance, footballers when taking a direct free kick, and tennis players looking to hit winners by hitting lines. Consistent means performing to a high level every time with control and quality. This is all about being able to replicate skills over and over again whilst maintaining quality of movement. It's consistency that allows basketball players to shoot free throw after free throw, helps cricket players to register huge scores and maintain high averages, and keeps a golfer near the top of a leaderboard for the four straight rounds needed to win a Masters tournament. Fluent means using movements that are quick, smooth and flowing without hesitation or stumbling. Gymnasts require fluency when linking moves together during a floor routine, while footballers produce quick, smooth movements to evade defenders and maintain ball control while dribbling. Coordination means moving different parts of the body together with efficiency and control. Almost all skills and movements in sport require the performer to use multiple body parts and muscle groups concurrently. For example, when serving in volleyball, the server uses their legs to generate momentum and their arms and eyes to strike the center of the ball. Aesthetically pleasing means a display that looks good to the eye of the spectator, judge or coach and is a particularly important characteristic for gymnasts, divers and figure skaters who are judged largely on the appearance of their actions. In games, aesthetics are far less important, and many athletes have become successful despite their unorthodox and arguably ugly methods. Goal-directed means focusing on a target and being determined to achieve that target. A performer whose performances do not reflect a clear plan or objective will almost certainly lack effectiveness. Imagine a boxer who enters the ring without a plan, or a footballer not interested in scoring goals. So skilled performers know what needs to be done to be successful, and make decisions and use skills that carry them towards their goals. So now that we've learned the six characteristics of skilled performance, let's study the role of each characteristic for a single example from sport, badminton. Accuracy is essential when performing drop shots, as too much height and pace could allow your opponent to smash the shuttle before it drops below the height of the net, while too little pace and it may not clear the net at all. Consistency is also essential, as the game cannot be won in a single point. Badminton players need to win up to three sets, and a high standard must be maintained for the majority of the game for this to be achieved. Effective movement around the court requires fluency, and skills should be performed quickly and smoothly. The game is extremely fast, and even a slight hesitation could cause you to fall behind in the point. Coordination is also essential for badminton players, who need to use their legs to adopt a stable, balanced position, and their arms and eyes to make sure the shuttle makes contact with the center of the racket. Now, although badminton players are not judged on style, a fluent player is likely to produce aesthetically pleasing performances, so how a performance looks is still a good indicator of skill level. Finally, badminton players must be goal-directed, as winning points is ultimately what determines the success of a performer. Skilled players do not waste a shot, and all their attention is focused on winning each point. Now you've just covered absolutely everything you need to know on topic 8.2, skilled performance. During our next lesson, we'll take a look at the different types of skills and how to identify them. So come back next time for topic 8.3 on skill classification. As always, I hope you found this lesson useful, and I'll see you in the next one.